Hello, Jocelyn. How are you? Can you hear me? Me escucha? Are you there? Hi, Jocelyn. Hello, um, Giselle. Gisela, how are you? Hello, Catherine. Nice to see you guys. Me escuchan. Can you hear me? Do you hear me? Me escuchan. Do you hear me? Okay. No, no problem. I understand. Yes, miss. Right, Jocelyn, I understand you're driving. Está camino a casa. I don't know if you're driving or whatever. Pero yo sé que ahorita no se puede conectar completamente. All right. So, guys, today we're going to continue practicing. Vamos a seguir practicando, guys. And um, I will show you the screen. Yo sé que nos quedamos pendientes de hacer algunas cosas. Así que, miren, guys, entre menos personas habemos, mejor, porque así practican más, ¿verdad? Don't you think so? ¿No creen eso? Do you hear me? Let's continue, guys. We were doing the... Aquí creo que nos quedamos en el three point. Vamos a poner este video. Let's watch this video en lo que los demás se incorporan. Let me know if you can hear with a thumb up. Hello to all of you. I want you to pay attention to the stress <laughs> given to the important words when speaking. In this lesson, participants will listen to sentence stress in order to improve Can you pronunciation. Hear? Do you hear? Sentence stress. Notice that the important words in a sentence have more stress. Excuse me. They're perfect. I like the blue one. They're not very attractive. The idea is for you to listen to the audio and then repeat. Practice. Ok, guys, acuérdense cómo pronunciar algo cuando ustedes le quieren dar más énfasis, ok? When you want to put emphasis in something, you need to stress on that word, ok? Esa palabra se pone un poquito más fuerte. Ok, help me read, please, Juan Antonio. Instructions. Good evening. Good evening. Lesson up with you. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation and will be introduced to comparison with adjectives by expressing preference. Preferences. Okay, thank you. Um, good, ex good, good, good pronunciation. So I'll cumber, no, it's cumber, conversation. Repeat, conversation, all right? Okay, thank you. Exactly, no, cumber. But así, sino que conversation. All right, thank you. All right. Um, which one do you prefer? Y este quiero que lo hagamos, guys, en un par de diálogos en parejas. Así que somos in this lesson, in this lesson, participants cuatro will para que lo hagan. And we'll be introduced to comparison with adjectives by expressing preferences. Which one do you prefer? Look, Pay these attention jackets on are the really nice. Please, okay? Which one Porfa? do you prefer? I like the wool one better. The wool one? Why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Hmm, there's no price tag. Excuse me, how much is this jacket? It's $499. Would you like to try it on? Uh, no. That's okay. But thanks anyway. You're welcome. Notice how the girls are talking about their preferences. In the next class, 
we will study how to express preferences and comparisons. How can we talk about preferences, guys? ¿Cómo se habla entonces de las preferencias? Veamos. Example. I can say, I like, digamos que tenemos dos cosas que estamos viendo, por ejemplo, pantalón o short, right? I like the pants more than the short. Ok, así se expresa lo que a usted le gusta. En lugar de decir I like, que me gusta, ¿cómo diríamos la otra opción, guys? I pre prefer. I prefer, all right, I prefer. Uh -huh. ¿Qué otra opción decíamos a pesar de, aparte de more? Stylish than the wool one. Hmm. There's no price tag. Better. Excuse Mira. me. Better. How much is this jacket? It's $499. Would you like to try it on? Uh, no. That's okay. Okay. ¿Quién quiere participar? Juan le toca porque usted es el chico, así que una de las chicas usted las escoge. Who, won, uh, who wants to read, guys? Pueden levantar la mano. If not, Juan will tell us. Si no, Juan escoge. Disculpe, ahí sería try it on. Try on. Try on. Try. Probarse try. algo. Try on. Uh -huh. Punta el try y el it. Try it. Try it. Ajá. Try. La Y con la E. Try it. Try it. Uh -huh. Try it. Yeah. Okay, guys. Do you want to do it? Just out with Antonio, yes? <laughs> Dale pues. Go! Usted comienza, you start to sell your end. Aunque son dos chicas, pero igual. A Juan quiero que, que, que participe hoy, ¿ok? Look, these jackets are really jacket, nice. This jacket, no. These jackets. Yes. Sorry, yeah, look right. These jackets are L look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? Which one do you I prefer? Like prefer, prefer. Repeat the question. Which one do you prefer? Which one do you prefer? I like the wool one better. The wool one? Wool Why? one. Wool one. It, look, it looks warmer. warmer. Well, I like the. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more. Sti more stylish. More stylish. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, that's not right. Yeah. Hey, disculpe, mire, excuse ¿cuánto cuesta esto? Hey, excuse me, how much is this jacket? Excuse me, how much is this, ja is this jacket? It's $499. Would you like to try it on? Uh, no, that's okay, but... That's okay, no. Oh, no that's, that's, perdón, perdón, that's, perdón, perdón. that's okay. No, that's okay, but thanks anyway. You're welcome. All right, vamos con Ada y Catherine, please, go. Good job, Juan and Gisela, okay. Come on, Catherine no, look. and Ada, go. No, no puedo look. ver la pantalla. Negro, no puedo ver las letras. No la puede. Entonces, Jocelyn, Catherine. 
Look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? Ada, can you see or no? Nada. Ada no ve nada. No, no, no uh, puedo. Ada, que, Ada doesn't see anything. Okay, and, and Jocelyn, se me perdió, Jocelyn, where are you? Aquí estoy, teacher, me acabo de estacionar. Ahorita, ahorita. Ah, okay. okay. Carlos, she, she's going school, to ask. ¿verdad? Sí, si gusta, continúe, please, if you, si sabe a dónde vamos, okay? Sí, sí. I like the wool one better. Wool one. The wool one better. Wool Me gusta la better. de lana. Uh -huh. I like the wool one better. The wool one? Why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one, wear it, one better. Uh -huh. It's well, more stylish I like the weather than... one better. I like the weather one better. Me gusta más la de, la de eh, cuero. Me gusta más el cuero. I like the weather, uh, the leather one better. Leather one better. Go. I like the leather one better. It's more styly than the wool one. Styly? No, stylish. Mm. Stylish. Mm, there's no price tag. Excuse me? How much is this jacket? How much is this jacket? How much is this jacket? Repeat. How much is this jacket? How much it? Much it? Much it? How much is this jacket? How much is this jacket? How much is this jacket? <laughs> it's four hundred ninety-nine dollars. Would you like to try it on? Oh no! Thank you. All right. Very oh, good. Oh no! Thanks, Kay. But thanks anyway. Oh no, that's okay. No, right. That's okay. Thank you, Maria. Welcome. Mira como se, se conectaron de último. You were the last one to be connected. I want you to read primero, Carlos, y usted le sigue, Maria. Estamos leyendo el diálogo, right? Go, Carlos. Okay. Look, this jacket are really nice. Which one do you prefer? Hello. ¿Cuál está leyendo? I like. Aquí va usted. En la de su. I like the world one better. Okay. I like the world one better. Repeat. I like the world one better. I like the world one better. Continue, Carlos. The world one. The world one? Why? Why, Maria? ¿Por qué? Warmer. It looks warmer, Carlos. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, there's no price tag. There no. There's. There's. There's no price tag. There's no price tag. Mm, excuse me. How much is this jacket? No se puede los números. It's four hundred. Four hundred. Four hundred ninety nine. It's four hundred ninety nine dollars. It's four hundred ninety nine. Continue, Carlos. Would be equal. Would you like to try it on? Would you like to try it on? Repitamos. Guys, everybody, would you like to try it on? Would you like to try it on? No, no, try it on. No, try it. Try it on. Try it on. Try it on. No. Would you like to try it on? Oh, would you like to to try it on. Hey, pero esa no es pregunta, María. Would you like to try it on? No, no. Would you like to try it on? Hey, ¿te gustaría probarla? ¿Probártela? Es una pregunta. Dele más entonación. Welcome, Eric. 
tarde mejor que nunca, right? Right. María. Continue. You're welcome. <laughs> no, would you like to try it on? Everybody, no les escuché ni a María. Try it on. Oh, no, that's okay. But thanks, anyway. Thanks, anyway, it's okay. Thank you, bye. Ahí tenemos al que siempre quiere participar. Um, vamos a ver dónde está. Can you see uh, now? Ahora sí puede ver. Yes, I see. Okay, you can see. Now you can see. Please, Eric, usted comienza y hágale, hágale sigue, please, go. Look, these jackets are really nice. Uh, which one? Jacket do you or jackets? Porque una es jacket y oh, jackets son sí. más. <laughs> Look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool ones better. The wool one? Why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, there's no price tag. Excuse me, how much is jacket? It's four hundred ninety nine dollar. How Would much is the like jacket? It? Guys, like come the on, one better. Oiga, the oiga, one? oiga, Why? Why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Hmm. There's no price tag. Excuse. There's no price tag, no. Mm, there's no price tag. Mira, ahí esta no tiene precio, ¿verdad? Esta no tiene la viñeta. All right. Necesito más entonación, guys. Ok. Escuchen nuevamente. Ya los demás lo escucharon, pero ustedes están como. Ah, oh, I'm better. A los warmer. No. Denle entonación, guys. Please. Excuse me. How much is this jacket? Excuse me. How much is this jacket? All right. Vamos, guys. Ahora sí, denle otra vez. Please, go ahead. Go. Desde el inicio. From the beginning, of course. Look. Espérame, this jacket... wait, Eric. Look, these jackets are really nice. Ada va a comenzar y usted va a hacer lo que ella hizo antes. A ver qué tan, qué tan bien, guys. Hemos... Eh, Asimilado esa entonación. Ok, vamos, Ada. Come on. Ahora usted es la que pregunta más. Ok, go. Look, this, this jacket are really nice. Jackets Which are, no, jackets are. Jackets are. La jackets. S es plural. Si digo jacket es is. Si no digo jackets are, y si no jackets is. Jackets is, jackets are. Jacket is, jackets are. Ok, go. Look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? It's $499. Vamos a ver si lo Would you like to try it on? Uh, look, these jackets are really nice. Bye. Repeat them, please. Re let's repeat. Look, these jackets are really nice. Hey, mira qué bonitas estas chaquetas. Hey, look. Hey, look, these jackets are really nice. Entonación, Ada. Come on, come on, come on. Look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool one better. Which one do you prefer? The wool I one. like the wool. Why? Wool one better. The it wool looks one? warmer. Why? It looks. Bye. Well, a lot. Go. Warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool. No es more stylish, it's more stylish. Wool one. 
Hmm, there's no price tag. Vaya, there's no price tag. No, hey, there's no price tag. No. Guys, denle entonación. Y si está así, mira, Eric, there's no price tag. Le va a costar hablar un poquito más. Así que, excuse me. Tengamos una How posición much is this mejor, jacket? ¿ok? It's $499. Would you like to try it on? Uh, no. That's okay. Ok, Eric. Ahora sí. Quitémonos la mano de aquí que nos duele la muela o no. Lo que sucede es que no oyo. Por en eso, este vamos a contestar. Iba a vamos a one contestar one. otra vez, ¿ok? Ada, you continue. Pero entonces... Estamos sí, cuando, yo contesto, no la te, cuando yo contesto no la tengo así. Ah, vaya. All right. That's good, ¿ok? Pero si estamos así, guys, en serio, la boca es como que no, ¿verdad? ¿verdad? You don't pronounce well. No pronuncia igual. Ok, Ada, come on. Así está Eric, vea, como que cuando me va a contestar Ada, vea. Uh -huh. Ay, Ada. Nos quedamos, Ada. I am Anne, you're Sue, Eric. Look, these jackets are really nice. Eric. Which one do you prefer? I like the wood one better. The wood one, why? It looks warmer. It's, oh, yeah, it looks. It's, it, oh, it looks... looks... Ah, it la looks... S no le lleva la ETS. Vea, ah, acuérdense que el ET y el ETS es algo diferente. Ah, it looks warmer, ok. It looks warmer. Well, I like the, the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Um, there is no price tag. Oh, excuse me, how much is this jacket? It's uh, $499. Would you like to try it in? On? Wool como wool otra vez o wood? Would you like to try wool it is on? Wool I like the wool one better. Okay, es el wood. Sin la L, solo se pronuncia la D. Would you? Would oh. you? Would you like to try it on? Try it on. Nah, try it on. All right, try it on. El titón no. Try it on. <laughs> wood? Would you like to try it on? Yeah, hey, good job, everybody. Would you like to try it on? Vamos, Catherine, repeat. Would you like to try it on? Would you like to try it on? Would you like to try it on? Pero con pregunta, o sea, más entonación. Gisela. Would you like to try it on? Would you like to try it on? Like try good job, on? Juan. Ya, él, ya me lo dijo una vez más, pero go ahead. Would you like to try it on? Ya ven, no, try it on, vea, no, try it on, no. Try it on, try it on, try it on, try it on. Carlos, would you like to try it on? Would you like to try it on? Pero me pronunció la L en el wood. Sí, pero aquí es wood, all right? Con la L, la L acá, guys, no la pronuncio, ¿ok? Would you, would, would, would. Everybody, would, would you, you like, like to try it on? Exactly. Thank you. Vamos con uh, Eric one more time. Would you like to try it on? Pero no es would you. Es es would, 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 would. El would es... Would. Ajá. Would. ¿Qué era would, would guys? You... Would you like to try it on? Ajá. ¿Y a qué se refería con would en lugar de would? Uh -huh. Me gusta más la de cuero, dice. Ah, pero a mí me gusta más la de lana. Ok. Would you like to try it on? And that's it, guys. Very good. And let's continue. We already started this. Ya lo vimos ayer. Aquí están, miren, chicos, si no lo copiaron ayer, aquí están las answers. ¿Sí? Si no se recuerdan, ahí están. Ok. Next.
By the end of the lesson, Jocelyn, are you there? No me encendió la cámara todavía. Ajá. She's not there. Okay. Um, his salary. Ya leímos esto, pero I want you to read again. Okay. Quiero que lo lean de nuevo. By the end of this lesson, you will be able to comprehend. You will be able. Will be. Will be able. Will be able. Will be able. Will be able to comprehend and use comparative able, adjectives. Able, no, a, able, 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 able to comprehend able. and use comparative adjectives. Okay, vale. Los comparative adjectives, ¿cómo se usan, guys? Ahorita lo vemos. Yo sé que ya lo saben, pero si hago preguntas, ocupo do. Which one do you prefer? ¿Cuál preferís? I prefer the blue one. Prefiero esta than the black one, que la negra. O puedo decir, I like the letter one than the... We recommend for you to study the adjectives in English in its comparative form. The letter than the letter one than the, than the woo one. Hi, everyone. As I told you last class, we will Can talk about how to express preferences in English as well as to compare. Yes. Let's see. Preferences. Comparisons with adjectives. Which one do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. Which one do you like better? I like the leather one better. Which one do you like more? I like the leather one more. That one is cheaper than the wool one. This one is nicer than the wool one. The leather jacket is prettier than the wool one. It looks bigger than the wool one. It's more stylish than the wool one. Spelling. Vaya, guys. Okay, so we have cheap, we have nice, we have pretty, we have big, and stylish. Okay, ¿en cuál ocupamos la única vez more? In what situation can we use more? When we're talking about comparisons with adjectives, When can we use more? ¿En qué momento ocupamos more? Porque si se fijan aquí, nicer than, prettier than, bigger than, cheaper than, pero cuando ocupamos more? Do you remember? Cuando son más de tres sílabas. De dos o más sílabas. Muy bien. Yeah, oh. Gisela. Very good. Ok, si termina con Y, pero es de dos sílabas, igual, ¿verdad? Se pone la Y en lugar, eh, se cambia en lugar... Eh, se pone en lugar de la I y ponemos e -E, igual. All right. Cheap. Cheaper. Nice. Nicer. Pretty. Prettier. Big. Bigger. To express preferences in English, we may say, I prefer. I like. ¿Cómo se habla Which entonces one? de preferencias, guys? Con el verbo... Prefer, o el otro, el verbo? Like. Like, ok. Prefiero más las computadoras que los teléfonos. How can you say that? I. Yo prefiero, I prefer the computers than the cell phones. Pero lo prefiero más que los teléfonos, se diría entonces, I prefer. The computers más que. The. More than. I, I prefer the computers more than cell phones. Ok. Eh, mi mamá es más bonita que mi tía. My mom is prettier than my uncle. Okay. Prettier than. Pero si digo, es más eh, preciosa que es gorgeous. 
Gorgeous. Dos sílabas sería entonces ahí, como dijo Gisela. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, no. Preciosa. I'm sorry. Preciosa, ¿cómo se dice? Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Se los escribo acá en el chat. Preciosa. Uh -huh. Gorgeous. Ajá. Uh -huh. How do you say that? Vamos a los comparativos. Sería it's more gorgeous. Ajá, my mom is more gorgeous than, ¿verdad? Y aquí tenemos, guys, después de dos sílabas ponemos siempre more, ¿ok? Acá tenemos los de dos sílabas o más. ¿Ok? Eh, porfa, póngale mute, María, porque a veces se le escucha un poquito distorsionado el audio, ¿ok? More example, guys. What do you like more? Do you like Androids or do you like iPhones? Androids or iPhones? What do you prefer? Puede decir better or puede decir more? Uh -huh. You can say better or more. No answers. Vaya, entonces, guys, si no tienen ninguna. Do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. Which one do you like better? I like the leather one better. When we want Pongamos to el video there, nuevamente and pay attention, in okay? By the end of this lesson, you will be able to comprehend and use comparative adjectives. Hi everyone, as I told you last class, we will talk about how to express preferences in English as well as to compare. Let's see. Preferences. Comparisons with adjectives. Which one do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. Which one do you like better? I like the leather one better. Which one do you like more? I like the leather one more. That one is cheaper than the wool one. This one is nicer than the wool one. The leather jacket is prettier than the wool one. It looks bigger than the wool one. It's more stylish than the wool one. Spelling. Cheap. Cheaper. Nice. Nicer. Pretty. Prettier. Big. Bigger. To express preferences in English, we may say, I prefer, I like. Which one do you prefer? I prefer the leather one. Which one do you like better? I like the leather one better. When we want to compare, we use the adjective in its comparative form. Bye, guys. We Aquí. use adjective plus er plus than. Small, smaller than. Okay. Si tenemos entonces el adjetivo, le ponemos ER. Si termina con Y, ¿cuál era la regla, guys? La Y se pone... La Y here. se pone como I, ¿verdad? Muy bien. Y siempre ponemos more, eh, ¿ponemos more o no? No. No. Solo dan, vea. Ugly, er, dan. Y si fuera más de tres sílabas, entonces decimos more... More than. More delicious, more difficult, more careful, more pretty. Eh, el sería esta, eh, esta bien, more pretty. Yes. More pretty. No, no. ¿Cómo que diga more, more faster? ¿Verdad que no? No, entonces solo es pretty air o faster. Ok, faster than. Ok, ahora, ¿cómo preguntamos entonces, guys? Ocupamos la WH question, un auxiliar para hacer la pregunta en simple present. María, por favor. Okay. 
Vamos a poner silencio. Eh, WH question. ¿Cuáles eran las WH questions, guys? What, why, where, who. Ok. Sería what, why, what else? Where. Where. When. When. Who. 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 Ok. Who. Y tenemos el último how, pero hay más, pero obviamente con esto es suficiente. Y luego el auxiliar. ¿Cuándo ocupamos el do y cuándo ocupamos das, guys? Do or does? Do, first person. Para third person. What are the third person, Catherine? ¿Qué, ¿Cuáles son las third person, decimos? He, she. He, she. He, she. He, she. Very good. Ok, entonces, el sujeto, guys, en lugar de it, ¿a qué podría decir yo en lugar de it? En lugar de it. Puedo hablar de la pelota, uh, ¿verdad? ¿Ya? The no. ball. Ball. Ajá. Cualquier objeto. ¿Qué más? Ball. Car. Cell phone. Animals. Any animal. Uh -huh. Solo it. Animals sería they, ¿verdad? ¿Qué más? What else? Computer, etc. Si hablo de, de ella, ¿de quién podríamos hablar en lugar de ella? She. My mom. Ella, mi mamá. Ajá. My daughter. My, my, my sister. sister. Ok, ¿qué más? What else? My, my grandma. 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 Uh -huh. Cualquiera que sea de ella. Ahora, he. Que, que en, en lugar de he, no necesito un pronombre, guys. Necesito cualquier sujeto. El pronombre sustituye el nombre, recuerden. So, if we're talking about something, algo, estamos hablando de qué? Un objeto, un evento. Si estamos hablando de she, estamos hablando de una mujer, ¿ok? De una chica. Todavía no está en el... Eh, todavía no está el... El, el de los... LGTB todavía, ¿no? pero está todavía, todavía él, eso, <ríe> él, eso y ella. <ríe> en todo caso sería it, me imagino, pero igual. He, en lugar de he podemos decir the teacher si es un hombre. Ajá, ¿qué más? The teacher. ¿Qué más? My brother. My brother, ya. Yeah. Uh, doctor. Da, doctor, nurse, puede ser nurse y doctor, él o ella, pero ¿cómo lo voy a descifrar si es él o ella en el contexto? Así que aquí tenemos entonces la estructura, guys. What does my sister, ¿cuál puede ser un verbo? What does my sister ¿Qué mi hermana? Clean. ¿Qué es lo que limpia mi hermana? What does my mo my brother my sister clean? All right. Y respuesta sería she. Tercera persona she. Yeah, Juan. She cleans, verdad? Tercera persona she cleans. Okay. Then, dígame otra per otra pregunta, guys. Auxiliary, siempre con una WH question, de las que ya hemos visto. Where, ¿dónde, dónde limpia ella? Ah, where does she clean? Where does your sister clean? Ok, another. Who is your brother? your brother o what is your brother vaya ese estamos hablando del verbo to be ok 
es un poco diferente al auxiliar do y das. El verbo to be, guys, simplemente decimos sujeto, si es afirmativo, pero si es pregunta, ocupamos am, is o are. Y luego el sujeto. ¿Ok? Ejemplo, are you tired? ¿Estás cansado? Más un complemento, ¿verdad? Are you a chef? ¿Sos un chef? Yes, I am. Pero en pregunta ocupamos el auxiliar do or does. Ok, another question. Va a preguntar, do you prefer rock music or ranchera music? Oh, I prefer music. I prefer rock music more than trap music or than ranchera music, ¿ok? Any other question? Pregúntame. Do you like pizza? Yes, I like pizza, but I prefer hamburgers than pizza. Prefiero más hamburguesas que pizza, ¿ok? Good question. This dress is smaller than the other one. I recommend for you to study the adjectives in English in its comparative form, so you're able to compare anything you want. I also want you to work with this, cheap, old, and new. These are adjectives. Okay. Comparar adjectives, vaya. ¿Qué me podrían decir entonces acá? ¿Cómo responderían, guys? Which dress is prettier than the... The yellow one or uh, the green one? What is your answer? I Hablando del verbo to be. Uh -huh. The green one is. Uh -huh. Answer. Dígame. Vaya, se lo voy a decir yo. Uh, which dress is prettier, the yellow one or the green one? Um, I prefer, prefer the green one. The green, the green one. one is better or nicer or prettier than the yellow one. Ok, vamos con la segunda. What, is the blue t-shirt red? Um, is the blue t-shirt larger, más grande? Is the blue t-shirt larger than the red and white one? Que, la, que la, 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 la azul, que la blanco y rojo, guys. What is the answer? No, right? Is the blue t-shirt más grande, larger than the, the red one in white? The red and white one? Yes or no? No. Entonces sería the the red and white, la roja y blanco, the red and white one is bigger. Bigger or larger? Larger than, than, blue, than blue t -shirt. Than the, the blue t-shirt. Okay, thank you. Ahora con number three. Look at these pants. Which ones do you like? ¿Cómo, re, ¿Cómo me responden eso? How can you answer? I prefer the pants, the, the black pants. Then, okay, I prefer the, the pants than, uh, than the, puede decir entonces, I prefer the blue pants than the black pants, or the black one. Prefiero el, el azul que el negro. Okay, o puede decir, I prefer the blue pants better than the black, okay? Um, 
Guys, do you have any questions? Yo lo veo bien callados. I see you very quiet. Any questions so far? No? Okay. Please help me read. Ayúdenme a leer, guys. Raise your hand, please. Hi, Ernesto. Can you continue? In your email message, you asked me, what do you do every day? What, what okay in your email message you ask me what do i do every day repeat in your email messages your you ask, email your email your email message you asked me what do i do every day continue well I'm a student at the University of Michigan. I really like my classes. I study computer, 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 science. computer science and Chinese. I go to a school around eight. Around, I go to, I go to school. I go to school around. I go to school around. I go eight. to school around. I go to school around eight in the morning on weekdays. Mm -hmm. Continue. Around... ¿Quién más quiere continuar leyendo? Who wants to read? Me, teacher. Around noon, continue. Around noon, I have lunch with some classmates. On Mondays and Friday, I work out no, I work out. Myself. Yo trabajo afuera es I work out. I work, I work out. out. No, work out es ejercitarse. I work out. I work, I work out. in the gym. I work in the gym. I work out. I work out in the gym. Before no, no, my it's class. work out. It's work out. Work out. Work, work out. out. Junta la K con la Work out. Work out. Work, work out. out. Exactly. Work I work out. in the gym. I work I in work the gym. Out. I work out in the gym before my class. Gym, no, gym es una bebida. Es gym, all right, gym, gym. con la M, all right. Yeah. I work at the gym. I work at in the gym before my class. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, who wants to continue? Uh, Carlos, go. Go and then Gisela. And I, and in the afternoon, in the late afternoon. Carlos? And in the late afternoon on Tuesdays and Thursday, my friend Daniel and I have part-time jobs. We work in the school cafeteria. Cafeteria? Has it? Cafeteria? Cafeteria. And I study in the library study. every and I study in the library every weeknight until about 2 a.m. Thank you. Okay, Carlos. Ahí le ponemos punto y comenzamos otra vez. I work out in the gym before my classes. And I, and I, and no. I, um, perdón, aquí dice, and then the afternoon, on Tuesday and Thursdays, la S me le faltó acá. I work at the gym before in the late afternoon. Tuesday, and my friend Daniel and I. Aquí es que decimos la D con la I. Mire. And I. And I. And I. My friend Daniel and I. And I my friend Daniel and I. Have part in jobs. We work in, in the school cafeteria. We work in the school cafeteria. And I study. I know it's I study. It's solo I study. All right. Repeat one more time. And I study in the library every weeknight until about 2 a.m. Go. 
and I study in the library every weeknight until about 2 a.m. And I study, and I study, and I study, and I study. Go, and I and study. I study. And All I right, study. thank you. All right, Gisela, I am full, I'm a full-time. I'm a full-time student. No, time. 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 I'm a full-time time full student. Full-time full -time student. student. I I'm a full time student and I don't ha have time to watch TV. And what do you do? <laughs> ah, pero ahí había un punto, ¿verdad? And I don't watch TV. And what do you do? Send me another email, please. Go. And what do you do? Send, send me another email, please. Thank your, you. Your um, friend, your your new a friend. Electronic friend. Es, a eso se refiere. Y friend. Ok. ¿Alguien ha tenido amigos solamente por internet, guys? Que nunca los ha conocido. Yo creo que no, ¿verdad? <ríe> But many people have. Que okay, si algunas personas tienen, chicos. Tienen conocidos. Ok. So we have the answers. Esa sí ya la vimos también. Todas las respuestas ayer las vimos. Así que, we finish with the letter F. No, ahí terminó. Aquí estamos con el four point and something. Si se fijan, guys, había un video en el que les quería mostrar el object pronoun. ¿Ok? Cuando estamos hablando de él, de ella, cuando recibe la acción ella, él o algo o ellos. Por ejemplo, aquí lo tienen. Miren, guys, tenemos mi cuando yo recibo la acción. Por ejemplo, si yo digo yo le gusto a él o yo le caigo bien a él, ¿cómo lo dirían? How can you say that? A mí, yo. I love you, me gustas tú, ¿ok? Pero si yo digo, tú me gustas, a mí. You like me, ¿verdad? No, es, you like me es tú me, eh, yo te gusto a ti. Si yo digo, tú me gustas a mí. I like Otra, you. I like you, pero al revés ahora. Usted, yo, eh, yo te gusto a ti, sería entonces, you like me. Like me, muy bien. A mí me gusta ella. I like she. Me gusta ella. Ella. Like her. Very good, I like her. María, do you want to say something? No sé por qué tiene el micrófono abierto, díganos. Me gusta, me encanta, McDonald's me encanta. I like I like tengo, it. I like it. Pero fíjese que tengo dos cosas y me gustan los dos teléfonos. I like them. 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 Muy bien. Them. Ok. Y si yo digo, mire, yo los conozco a ellos. How do you say conocer? Saber o conocer? No. No. I know them. Ok, el verbo. Sujeto, verbo, objeto. ¿Cómo diría yo los conozco a ustedes? I. I know. No. Ustedes, muy bien. Y ellos nos conocen a nosotros. Ellos. They know. Ah, it's very good. Ok, I, they know me, me conocen. They know us. A ambos. O más de dos, ¿verdad? They know us. Ok. Todos me conocen en su chitoto, guys. How can you say that? Everybody knows, con la S, knows me, all right, knows me. Very good. Pregúnteme, ¿me conoces? ¿De dónde me conoces? Pregúnteme, ask me. Where do you know me? Exactly, where do you know me from? Okay, from, ¿de dónde? All right, por, por ejemplo, where are you from? Where do you know me from? ¿De dónde me conoces? 
Ok. Eh, pregúnteme, eh, ¿juga, eh, ¿jugás voleibol? Muy bien, ahora, ask me. ¿Juega Juan voleibol? Does, does, does Juan, verbo, play, play what? Voleibol, ok. Volleyball. Very good. No, eh, él no juega, ahí diríamos, doesn't. He doesn't play voleibol. Hey. Si él juega, le ponemos la tercera persona. Yes, he play. plays. Plays. Basketball, plays volleyball, whatever. Ok. We need more information when answering. <ríe> sí, acuérdense que cuando decimos why, where y todo eso, no solo es yes y no, ¿verdad? Sino que damos más información. Por ejemplo, eh, why do you work? Who works? ¿Quién trabaja? Who works here? Yo sé que la mayoría, but who works here? Carlos, all right. Ahora yo le pregunto, where do you work? Ahí dicen dónde, ¿verdad? Where. ¿Cuál otra pregunta podríamos hacer? En lugar de where, ¿de dónde trabajas? ¿Por qué? ¿Cómo? ¿Y cuándo? ¿Ya? Why? When? Why? When do you work? Carlos, when do you work? Y usted me pregunta, por favor, al resto, otra con WH question. Aquí debo, las debo... tenemos, guys. Ajá. Perdón, ¿qué debo hacer, Ticha? Where or when do you work? Answer me. Where do you work? Donde? Or when, 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 cuando? When do you work? For example, I work from Monday to Friday. Or sometimes from Monday to Thursday. When do you work? Cuando? When, when do you work? Mm -hmm. Answer me ahora, correspondame. No es yes, I work or no, I don't. ¿verdad? Sino que tiene que responderme. ¿Dónde trabajo, de, trabajo yo? When, no where. When, when. I said when. I work. In, I, no sé cómo from decir. Monday to Friday. ¿De lunes a viernes? From Monday to Friday? No, uh, from ver, Saturday. From Saturday, Saturday to... Uh, Thursday. Sábado jueves. This, sábado jueves. From Saturday to, to, to Thursday. Jueves. Thursday. From Saturday from to. to... De, ah, uh -huh. From Saturday to Thursday. Hey, you have Fridays. Solo, solo trabaja. So you only. You only rest. Friday. Solo Friday. el viernes. Today is yes. your only day off. Yes. Solo ahora. Yes. Y mire qué mal que tuvo que estar en la clase, pero qué bueno que se conectó, Carlos, ¿ok? And guys, the rest, vamos a ver, pregúnteme algo más. Ahora le preguntamos, hey, why do you work? ¿Y por qué creen que trabaja uno? Ah, oh, because it's very interesting. I really like to work because I get very, I get busy all my day, all, all my day on, etc. Entonces, guys, ¿por qué trabaja? Uh, because I need to work, because I have to pay my bills, I have to pay my studies, I have to pay my university, my rent, my bills, uh, my bills, los, los recibos, right? My water bills, my electricity bills, uh, what else? Ahí decimos el why. Ahora, ¿cómo trabajas? Uh, how do you work? I work very well. Okay. Why, where, when. Ok, vamos a ver. Otra pregunta, guys. Anything else? Esta entonces, guys, es la estructura, ¿verdad? WH question, do or does. Si es tercera persona, pues decimos she, he or it. En lugar de she, podemos decir my mom, lo que sea que estemos hablando. Eh, refiriéndonos a la mamá, el papá o a alguna mujer. El he, algún hombre. El et, algún objeto, cosa, evento. Si estamos hablando de they, estamos hablando de una cosa, 
un, dos chicas, dos chicos o varias personas, ellos. Ok, any questions so far? ¿Tienen alguna duda, guys? Porque aquí terminamos básicamente la section 3. If you don't have a question, I wish you the best and have a good night. Si no tienen preguntas, les deseo lo mejor y feliz noche. I see you on Monday, ok? Ok. No questions so far? No questions. All right, have a good one, guys. Stay safe.